Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when audio is not working with the game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to open game bar. So you can press Windows plus G on the keyboard. And then once the game bar is open, select the right audio device. So press Windows plus G on the keyboard. This will open game bar. Now click on the speaker icon at the top. And then over here, you can select the right speaker. So make sure that the, you select the speaker which you want to use. Now scroll down. And over here also, if you find uh, when, when the game is running, you will see the game over here. So make sure the audio for the game is not on mute. You can set it to 100 and then check. You can even go to voice and then you can select the microphone and the speaker which you want to use from the drop down option and then you can check. Still not working. Then at the bottom right here, you can see, you can see the speaker icon. Click on it and then click on this select a sound output. And over here, uh, you can select the right speaker. If you have multiple speaker over here, select the speaker which you want to use. And for the game, you will see the game over here. If the game is running, you can set this volume to 100 and make sure it is it is not on mute. Again, make a right click on the speaker icon and then go to sound settings. And over here also make sure you have the right audio output selected over here. Now, the next step is to restart the game. and if, the, if that is not working, close the game and then restart the game and, and then check. If that does not work, restart your computer once and then check. Still not working. The next step is to set sound sample rate to 48,000 or 44,000 hertz in sound control panel. Now for this, type in control panel in Windows search box. Click on control panel and then go to hardware and sound. Go to sound. This will open sound control panel. Now you have to select your speaker, the speaker which you are using, and then you can go to properties, make a right click, go to properties, go to advanced tab. And over here, you might see multiple uh, uh, like sample rate. You have to select, you can try this 24 bit 48,000 Hertz and then hit apply. Apply is important and then relaunch the game. You can even select 16 bit 48,000, hit apply, click on OK, relaunch the game. You can even try 44, 100 Hertz, 24 bit, 16 bit, 16 bit. Each time when you make changes, hit apply and then you have to relaunch the game and then check. Make sure that you relaunch the game. Now, still uh, still not working. The next step is to, if you're playing with a controller, disconnect the controller when you start the game. Connect the controller back once the sound is established in the game. Now, the next step is to turn off spatial sound. Now, for this, again, open sound control panel. Select your speaker, make a right click, go to properties, spatial sound. If this is set to Windows Sonic for headphone, you can set it off and then hit apply. Apply is important, then click on OK. And if it is already off, you can try Windows Sonic for headphone, apply and then relaunch the game and then check. Next step is to disable other audio device. Like if you have a coolest voice meter audio device under, you have to disable it both under recording and playback in sound control panel. Now for this, you can click on the sound control, open sound over here. And then again, make a right click and then go to now over here uh, under playback. If you see a coolers over here, voice meter over here or any audio device which you are not using, you can make a right click and disable it. I don't have a coolers voice meter or any other audio device. If you have it, make a right click. You can keep the speaker which you want to use enabled. Rest you can disable and then check. Do the same thing in the recording tab, the microphone or uh, or the audio device which you want to use, keep that enabled. Rest, you can make a right click and you can disable it. And then check. Do the same thing in device manager. Make a right click and then go to device, make a right click on the start menu and then go to dis, uh, device manager and expand sound, video and game controllers over here. And over here, if you have a coolest voice meter or any other audio device, make a right click and disable the de device. Whichever audio device you're using, you can keep it enabled, rest you can disable and then you can relaunch the game. Later on when you need it, you can enable it once again. Now the next step is to uncheck hands-free telephony. Now for this, you can type in run in Windows search box and then click on run. And in this open uh, box, you can just click on OK. And over here, uh, you will see your speaker over here. So make a right click on your speaker and then go to troubleshoot option, go to services option, And over here, you can see hands-free telephony. If you see this option, you can uncheck it, hit apply, click on OK, and then relaunch the game and then check. 
once you are done playing the game if you want to enable hands free telephony uh, you can put a check once you are done playing the game put a check on hands free telephony apply okay and then check next step is to verify the game file so if nothing is working uh, you can try this make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrative game files once the verification is 100% complete launch the game and then check the sound so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix the audio issue with the game so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel